Welcome to another Spread Cheaters video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spread Cheaters website. In this video, we'll see how to find the slope in Excel. Excel is widely used for mathematical operations. When working with Excel, you may need to find the slope of a set of coordinates. There are three ways of doing this. The first way is to create a chart and find the slope of the line. So let's do that. I'll select the data, go to insert, uh, expand the scatter option and select scatter with uh, straight lines. So now we have a chart. Now we can go to chart design, say add chart element, select trend line and go to more trend line options. So this opens the format trend line pane. I can then just scroll down and say display equation on chart. So as you can see, an equation is displayed on the chart and the slope is the uh, number preceding the x. So in this case, the slope is 1.5. So this is one way. The second way is to use the slope function in Excel. So what I uh, will do is type the function slope. And now I need to, the first argument is the range of y's and the second argument is the range of the x's and then close the brackets and press enter. And here I have the slope using the function. Now the third way is to use the formula itself. So let's type in the formula. This is y2 minus y1, close brackets, divided by x2 minus x1 and press enter. So again, we can get the slope in this way. When typing the formula, of course, you have to follow all the basic mathematical uh, rules and ensure that there are brackets so that you get the correct result. This is how to find the slope in Excel. Please read the appended article for further guidance.